Good morning, friends and fellow farmers. Oh, no, let's, uh, let's not do that. It is the 28th. It's the last day of spring. Oh my gosh. Good morning. Right, so planting spring seeds would have been a bust anyway. <laughs> my plans. Oh, my plans. Uh, and also my inability to put coffee where it needs to be. All right, let's see. How's things looking? Oh, wow. Is that... I don't see anything dancing in here. That is a lot of wine. I feel like I'm gonna have to come and deal with that. Yeah, I don't see why I couldn't come and deal with it now. Put the spring onions away. Just clear out anything I don't need to have here. All right. Wowzers. Prepare the ax. So, uh, let's do this. Oh my gosh. Okay, and then all these. I mean, uh, the way I guess I can tell, if there was one that wasn't finished, I would just, like, let it have some time. Right, so, I, yeah, ideally I don't actually have to axe all of it out. I was thinking I have to, like, empty this place. But all I gotta do is come in and get at the ones I can't easily get at. That's all. Okay. Okay, so, uh, yeah, I mean, it doesn't really matter, does it? I'll come down and do, like, one whole row here. I've never done this before of, like, going through and, you know, massacring all my, my supply. And then working my way out. That's not a thing I've ever attempted, so we're learning something here. What's the best approach to doing this? Okay, uh, yeah, this, this isn't too bad. This is going to be worth a, uh, a fortune in iridium grade starting wine, so definitely worth that. My goodness. Uh, so we can go two rows up, right? Oh, crud. Oh, you. Okay, there we are. Yeah, that worked out quite nicely. I have no idea what all this is going to be worth. But it'll be worth a bit. Oh, I didn't probably need to get the end one. Okay, so there we go. We got all that. There, yeah, that's not bad. Yeah, okay, I could have probably done a better job with this, but that's not too bad. And we'll get that other row as we go back. It's the, uh, I think the backing out is the only thing that takes a little bit of time. Okay, let's uh, have some coffee here. I don't know if that's a good idea or not, but whatever. Um, oh, okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like, why do I only have uh, blank type? Okay, so let's get these and then we'll come and... Oh, no, I wanted this one. I think I might have forgot in one of them or something. Okay, so uh, now we're at the other stage, so I will put these here. So we got 188 bottles. Uh, again, there might have been a better way of doing it. And uh, let's get this one here. These ones are well, kind of weird. There we go. It worked. Okay. There we go. Ah, I see. Yeah, I, oh, no, I can't. Yeah, I can get this one. Okay, just a pain, but doable. Okay. There we go. Yep, there we are. Yeah, what I'm, I was kind of curious to see is like, how long does this actually take to do? How much effort is this comparative to like the income? 
and even doing it like when you're just recording, um, you know, or not recording, when you're just doing this for fun. Uh, I was like, how bad is this? And uh, the answer is not bad. It's probably worth it. So this will, I probably change the way I do this. I was totally thinking that you'd have to like ax the whole business, but like really, it could be worse. Because it didn't take that long for us to fill it. It does take a little bit longer to extract them, but that's okay. Okay. Is it being a little bit more methodical? This is where using, playing with a keyboard and mouse probably slightly easier. Uh, back over to you. Okay, then we'll come down here, same deal. Oh, this isn't bad. And the other good part is this will all now be lined up on one day, so we won't have to keep checking on it. But it does seem to go from iridium gold to iridium pretty quick, and then iridium to done. I don't know, it all, the, the last bit of the process didn't... It's hard to tell. Time moves weird in this game. Uh, we can do both of those. And then we'll do... Then you. Then you. Okay, and then you. And then put these ones here. There we go. It does still end up being a lot of the day though, doesn't it? It's funny because normally like you get caught up in things where I think that the clock slows down or the, the clock stops for certain things. This is one of those activities that like the whole day is just chewed up and you know, I don't feel like I got very much done. <laughs> but this is like one fast day. That's very satisfying though. And I get we are as packed as we're gonna get, aren't we? And you. Okay, so now I guess we load up this side. Now where is my Mac? Okay, I can't put one there, but I can put one there. Okay, and then you and you, you and you, and that's all I have for casks, so I'm guessing I wasn't able to place anything else. No, that's red, that's red, that's red, that's red. Okay, I think that's it, so perfect. That's a very, uh, I, I shouldn't look too close, because did I... I missed that one in the far corner. Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> oh my gosh. That's, uh, my head just exploded seeing that. So 188, so I need to get some more star fruit, star fruit wine in here. I cannot believe. <laughs> no, you know what? I can totally believe that I forgot that one in the corner. Oh my gosh. All right, well, let's get our espresso. It's funny that they just start gathering as I come out of the house, because I haven't left the house yet. Uh, Pierre's cash pack. We got 530G. Thanks, Pierre. Interesting. So if you didn't come outside for the day, would the Junimos not harvest? Oh, the cat's good. That's interesting. Let's go get all the stuff. Like, it's the end of the day, so did they just simply not really gather today? Is that what just happened? I feel like that's what just happened. That's super weird. Oh. What did I grab out of here? Uh, I don't even know what I grabbed out here. Oh, it might have been the ink. That's fine. I can put it. We don't need the ink. And we uh, we put it in our sales pit. 
All right, let's, uh... Yeah, did the pigs not even come out today? That's all really weird. I feel like, yeah, it was a weird day because I didn't leave the house until everything. So the Junos, there we go. They are clearing it up, but, oh, there's one. Okay, I was like, you can't even see them. There they are. Let's dump off, so 291 uh, aged starfruit wine. So there's our, our big uh, haul. I feel like these sell for, what, about 6,000 each? So, uh, say 300 times 6,000. Is that 6 million? Is that... what is that? Uh, 300, 6,000, so add four zeros. One, two, would be... Three, four, I, I don't know, maybe. <laughs> I can't do math when I'm playing games. I, I just panic. I freeze up. Okay, well, we've got all of these. We've got all these seeds we no longer really want. That's fine. Um, okay, that's... yeah, that's all good. Let's dump all this stuff off then. And... Since I am keeping all the seeds out of the island, I should really kind of keep them consolidated. Um, and as for like this stuff, I, maybe I'll put it here now. I don't even know what like what do I really want with that. I'm not even sure. Okay, and then uh, yeah, let's head out and put these seeds where I would probably go to look for seeds, which would be out on our island. I should probably gather the island stuff as well now. Yeah, this stuff here. So I kind of left it all. Oh, there, I thought there was going to be more. Hey, bud. Anything good today? Galaxy Soul for 10 radioactive bars. It's good to know I can do that. That's a lot of radioactive bars. I mean, given how much they, they are worth. But if you don't want to do the Mr. Key stuff, that is a good source of them. I never think about that. Um, definitely we've got a bit of oak resin. This is good for keg making. Okay, and then... Yeah, I think I'm just going to leave this alone. Let's hit the farm. I always want to hit jungle or one of the other things. Because it does feel like you're going... Like you... Am I going into the farm? It feels like I'm going into the jungle. Okay, some pineapples are up. Oh my gosh. So it turns out to be harvest day. That's fine. Hopefully it wasn't load the wine kegs day, because that's that's not happening today. There's no way I have the ability to do that. Okay, let's go get these. It is a solid amount of stuff. Yeah, here I was thinking I wasn't going to get like anything done today. It's like, oh, that's it. The day's hooped. Uh, let's put our flowers away here now, because I don't need those anymore. Um, yeah, okay, that's all good. Sure, I'll take some coffee beans. So yeah, that, that all that honey I'm growing out in the, that big area in the south of the main map, I, I feel like uh, since I can't really do level it up, I'm guessing, I guess, again, somebody told me what the pricing was. I mean, I'm guessing it's still worth turning into mead. Uh, I feel like it would be by a wide... I mean, anything it seems like processing. There seems to be very few things that are not worth processing. I, it comes down to time. Time isn't a factor. Like, I'm, I, I, people always count a variable of like cost per day or amount made per day. But since if you take time out of the equation, you just go, eh, like, what's it worth? And we're not trying to like race, we're not speedrunning on the income here, so time doesn't matter. 
the main idea would be is do, do I make more out of it in the long run? Sure. We have so many of each kind of machine and each kind of thing that it's kind of moot, I feel like. I don't know. Oh yeah, we got a bunch of kegs up. <laughs> oh my gosh. Of course we do. I think it's more important that I gather all of these crops. There we go. Yeah, I didn't expect that. And I'm, I'm looking forward to getting back out to the mines, but, you know, yeah, we didn't get that much resources the last time. Um, I'm trying to think of what other way I could approach this. I, I mean, I could go to the Skulky Mines with my newfound drop thing. Although, again, I you know, what drops iron bars? Uh, I, I could go to the higher levels, I guess, of the Skulky and uh, do a bunch of ball mining and stuff. Um, but I ultimately, it's going to be... A, I want, like, crud tons of copper. Uh, so that's more what I'm interested in. For the transmutation. So I don't know. We'll see. Oh boy. Every time I get, I, I go around the edging here, I get a little bit of stuff and I think, oh, okay, this is going pretty well. And then you look at the middle and it's like, it seems like such a daunting, although it's probably less space than we've already done. But it's so condensed, it seems like it's a mammoth pile of stuff. Yesterday I ended up uh, a, a kind of a last minute. Some friends needed some help moving some stuff, and uh, I, I haven't done a move in a while. Like I'm, I'm older, and most of my friends are settled. <laughs> they don't move around. I used to move around a lot, and so I think we did well, at one point. It was like 15 moves in like 10 years. It was some ridiculous amount of moving we had done um, when we were younger, and uh, I think. We're not big fans of moving anymore, and we, we have a lot of heavy things like books and such, and it it's a lot. And when you have dozens of boxes of just really, really heavy stuff, you're like, this sucks. I don't want to move anymore. So helping other people move, I was like, okay, that, I'm good with spatial reasoning. I'm good with packing trucks and stuff, but I haven't moved in a while. I'm not sore, but I'm just tired. It was a lot, unexpectedly. But then... I realize other other people. I was feeling competent when I moved, and I realize other people are just as incompetent as me in terms of like uh, being organized and being ready. Like I've gone to help some people move where, you know, when you show up, they're they're done. They they've like everything is packed. They've cleaned the place as much as they could. Like they've just put the effort in up front, and they're ready to go. Uh, the move yesterday was the the, the help was more of a panic help it was not planned in advance and so it was like i we showed up and did like i don't know you know six and a half hours of moving and it was not a it was a, an emergency move more than anything those moves are just chaos stuff is impact you're you're helping pack a kitchen those kinds of things so uh yeah it's uh my inability to do math probably has something to do with that in uh, in addition to my normal state, <laughs> just tired, <laughs> not sore, just tired. Thankfully, not a lot of heavy things, but definitely reminds me, uh, reminded me, reminds probably anytime anybody does a move, it probably reminds you why you don't want to move. I, it's I mean it's a good excuse to deep clean and clean out a junk drawer and get rid of things that you truly don't need. Um, but uh, you also end up with like. You know, I, I, it's just all so much stuff. They they hadn't, uh, you know, there's some things they hadn't like, gone through in a while, clearly. And so uh, I volunteered to take like six laptops and two PCs to the recyclers for them. Uh, and like, I mean vintage, like, like really, really, really old. And things that just people kind of put it aside and don't know what to do with. Or, you know, at that time period, uh, PC recycling wasn't even a thing. So you kind of, things just get put in the storage uh, area and then not dealt with. So there was a lot of weird, weird stuff that was just like, yeah, it's a lot. <laughs> it's 
so it's, it's still ongoing. But anyway, that's uh, that's what I've been spending my time doing. Surprise, you're moving today. But I'm, I'm thankful I have not had to move in a long time. It's been eons since I've moved, and I would love to keep it that way. Because I don't want to have to move. It does remind me, though, the importance of, like, cleaning. Or, you know, that kind of whatever people call it, death cleaning. Where you, you deep clean and you get rid of the weird stuff that other people are going to have to deal with if you just unexpectedly explode one day. Because that's how most people, you know, we, we just explode. That's, uh, if you're going to go, it's unexpectedly, it's going to be in a ball of white light. No, it's the just the idea of, like, you know, getting rid of papers and crud that no one else ever wants to deal with. I thought these were growing moss for a second. Um, you know, I'm going to wait until next time because there's really no point deal dealing with this, is there? That is a lot of stuff. So, well, yeah, we are at a point now where we have over 2,000 ancient fruit. Yeah, I'm at, like, well over two loops of kegs, so I definitely need to get some kegs built. Um, well, that's fine. We got a lot of things harvested there. My goodness, that was that was a lot. And yeah, we'll get those. She'll come and get my stuff here. So what do we have? Twelve bars and twenty-four. Okay. So got you know eighty-four. 300 some copper. Yeah, I've only got, well, we, I have enough I could get like four of uh, Galaxy Souls, really. I mean, we're sitting okay on those. It's a surprising amount of stuff. Oh, no. Oh. And then. I'm gonna run out, there we go. Ran out of ores. Well done. Bye bye. Nice to see you. Thanks for coming. Uh, and then the iron, I guess. Yeah, we can get that going. But once again, it's not going to be much. There we go. That's all done now, too. Okay, so... Uh, oh, yeah, okay. Cool. May as well take it all. And that other stuff's going to take a little bit. 399. Okay, so we could make 13 kegs. Uh, again, if I made some more, uh, I, I, you know, I am going to do that. Then I'm going to transmute some of it. How much, though? Okay, let's make... And then 46... Okay, and then make a few more. Yeah, it's, this is uh, such a weirdly inefficient way to do this. Then... Okay, I'm actually out of wood. <laughs> what? I'm out of wood? Alright, well we made 66 more kegs. That's good. Uh, wow. Yeah, so I could take this and... Uh, Get uh get shipping. Hey, I gotta go to bed in like five seconds here, but Okay, and then go to sleep. So we got two hundred and twenty seven wood. There we go, that'll make like seven more kegs. Whatever it is. Is it thirty per? It's a lot. Oh, we didn't make it. Alright, we'll see you all next time. Till then, bye bye.